Hey, so today I will be opening a Hypercrate Deep Core Explorers pack, which is the new pack, and it has a lot of cool decorations in it, a uh, monocycle speeder, well, hopefully it has a monocycle speeder in it, um, uh, the brakes, some other mounts, and you know, all the other random stuff you can get. So you get 24 Deep Core Explorers packs and one bonus Platinum pack, which is kind of an exciting addition, I think. So let's see what we get. I'm going to save this one for last, though. All right, wish me luck. I don't have any of the decorations yet. Oh, that I can use because I can buy decorations with that too. So um, I'm really hoping for some cool decos because I haven't bought them simply because I, I feared I was going to buy one of these hyper packs once they came up on the GTN. What is that, a rep item? Yeah, looks cool, but it's just a reputation item. There's a crystal, can I preview it? I can't because of the stupid outfit designer. Duelist jacket's kind of cool. Probably fairly common, I imagine, though. Um, oh, there you go, Temple Ceiling Lamp. I'll take that. And a Scorpio customization. <laughs> they have such great icons for the reputation stuff. If only it actually really meant something. Um, oh, Meditation Chamber. That's kind of cool. I should probably preview that, shouldn't I? There's the Temple Light. Um, and there's the Meditation Chamber. Some of these would actually probably look good in this stronghold, but um, I don't know if I'll use them here or in the new Yavin one. I'd like to use them in the new Yavin one, but uh, I don't know if they'll actually fit with the theme there. Just a blaster rifle. I can't preview that, I don't think. Oh, I can. That's weird. I can preview blaster rifles, but not lightsabers. Yeah, it's okay looking. It's probably pretty common, though. Not worth uh, 250 cartel coins or whatever. Or even 250,000 credits. Credit explosion and another certificate. Um, another crystal. Let's see. Serenity's Unsealed Saber Staff. Try saying that five times fast. Um, well, I do play Serenity, but uh, I have like a slight saber for that. That's kind of cool. It's an interesting design concept. Let me see if I can preview that crystal now, maybe. Yeah, there we go. Um, is that... Yeah... Not really a fan of the colors there, but it's different at least. I'll give it that. Am I like that? Just oh, there it is. <laughs> okay. Oh, did I not? Maybe I didn't accept that. That's why. All right. Take two. Oh, Jedi Council table. That's kind of cool. And a speeder. It's not a great speeder, but whatever. Hoping for a monocycle or at least a break. Really a monocycle, because that'll sell for a lot. If I even sell it, I don't know if I'll use it or not. I'd probably sell it. Toon Sorcerer robe. That's interesting. It's not in a. It's not in like a pack. It's just the actual robe. Hmm. I guess because there's no. There's a headpiece. I don't know. <laughs> just random bracers too. Temple sconce. Only only get one of those. That kind of sucks. You think you get like four of those? But I will take it anyway, just for the prestige. Okay, some boots to go with my Tun Sorcerer. Is this the rifle we had before? I think it probably is. No, I'm on the mount, so I can't preview it. Yeah, same one. Oops. Come on, where's the good stuff? Uh, again, got me excited, but not actually that exciting. An emote, a blaster. Yeah, it's, it's alright, I guess, but I won't be using it. Um, Minas Iris. That's a cool speeder, but actually it does not sell for that much. Only like 200k, which we were actually just discussing in Gilchat a second ago. They're just too common, and pot racing speeders aren't as rare anymore. There's too many of them. Vanny Chamber. That might be kind of cool. Another Sorcerer Robe. Um, another Certificate. Terran Tata Catch. I think that's kind of cool, I guess. I don't know how rare it is. Oh, <laughs> I do like that. Now, Tarantotic Mount, that would be cool. That's, uh... I'm sure they'll come out with one eventually. Kind of a shame that's not the Season 5 Mount. That would have been a good PvP Mount, I think. Uh, oh, there you go. These are... Oh, there's some random low B in my stronghold. Um, that's pretty cool, actually. Those guys are kind of rare, I think. But I might just use... Oh, and another table. But I might just use mine, because, uh... Look at, what is the Blast Rifle doing? What the... 
I guess because I previewed the Jedi Master walking around, it's doing that? Or this Terran Tidek has telekinetic powers? Alright, that's weird. But kind of cool. No complaints. Okay, not complaining. Stupid gloves. Galactic Wanderer title. And he's the Wanderer. Yeah, the Wanderer. Oh, there you go. Coastal Armored Ractal. That is nice. Although I already have a uh, non armored Coastal Ractal somewhere. Let's see. I don't know what the difference is. Nope, I want to preview it. Can I not? Can I not preview things? No. Okay, well, you can kind of see. Sorry, it's so cluttered. Um, there's a regular coastal, and there's the armored. And I am not really seeing the difference. Oh, I guess these things, maybe? Yeah, it just has like a... Oh, okay, it's actually, it's actually armor, I see. It's very... Okay, I guess it does kind of have like the armor around it, but I mean... Yeah, I think I'd rather just have the plain one, to be honest with you. That is my favorite type of Ractal, though, so that's kind of cool. Um, Alright, back to opening things. Although, actually, let me... I'm going to pop some of these rep items. And uh, dump some of these in my cargo bay. I'll dump them in this cargo bay. Just to make room. Where's that credit boom? I can use that. See it. Probably put it away already. Alright, that should be enough space for the rest. Alright. Let's see what else we get. Another lightsaber, another temple sconce. You really need like a lot of those to make them actually like look nice, so. I guess it's gotta got more than one, but with how rare they are, it's uh, I don't know if it might be worth just selling it. Selling the extras. Another Jedi Master, cool. I'm pretty sure those go for a lot. Let's check it out. Where is it? Keldor. Um, actually, they're going down in price now that more people have them. So, only about 300k. It's not bad, though. It's worth about the pack it came in. Another speeder. There you go. Oh, that's a, that's a nice one. I don't know if I want to use that, though, or if I want to, uh, if I want to sell it up. Oh, I don't know how much it sells for. I really want the prestige, and I'd probably use that eventually. I don't know if I'd use it in this stronghold, just because there's. I kind of like how this one is already, and I don't know if there's a hook I'd really want to put it on. But um, I'll, I'll definitely think about that. Another Tarantata Catchling. I wonder if that's worth anything at all. I hope so, but it's kind of cool looking. Uh, did I spell that wrong? I probably did. No, I don't want to preview it. Yeah, okay. So they're not really worth that much. They're kind of cool looking though, so maybe if I hold on to it, it'll go up in price, or I might just use one just to put it in a stronghold somewhere. Um, another one of those reputation items. Jedi Library. Oh, I actually want a couple of those, because I have uh, the old library wall thingies in here, but I'd rather have these be the Jedi Libraries, because that'd be, that'd be cooler, I think. I might replace these um, Rakata with some Jedi, too. We'll see. Alright, last actual pack. Wish me luck. Here we go. And another Jedi Master. Okay, that's okay. Experience boost. All right, and now we have the uh, the Deep Core Platinum Pack, which contains one extra rare or better item. So just one item. So hopefully it's a good one. Maybe another Throne of Enlightenment or a or a Monocycle. Could it be? And elegant Duelist gloves. Wow, that was a waste. Um. Alright, well, I got some decent stuff out of that anyway. It was probably worth it. Got some decorations, which is what I really wanted. Some XP boost, some uh, Java junk. No monocycle or even a rake, but um, the Throne of Enlightenment probably sells for a lot if I end up selling that. Let's see. On our server, it goes for... Oh, a mil. Is that it? Wow, I thought it was more than that. It seems kind of cheap. Anyway, um, yeah, I guess it was still probably worth it after all that. And... At the very least, it was fun. So thanks for watching, and if you open one of these hypercrates, I hope you have some good luck as well.